Howdy! Got new conditions for a field today. Um, I did a bit of work on his roof. Um, we installed a balcony um, and fiberglass it and he's got all his deck chairs out. Um, I only thought about him last night, so I gave him a bell. And um, no one's going to detect it on the field. It's right close to the bypass. Um, as you can see, it's right close to the bypass there. There's this field, that field, there's another field over there, and no one's ever been on them. And I've got all the way up there and all the way down there. And apparently, I'm one of these fields. We used to play football in the 1900s, the village team. So, a little bit of luck, I'm going to find something. Let's start for this small field because the place is quite overwhelming, to be honest. Um, and then um, just see how I get on. But, cool, brand, brand new fields, right next to the bypass. Been a farm forever, and no one's ever been on here. So, lovely job, let's go. I've only been on here a couple of minutes. I've um, got a first signal. Um, it's not iron, but what it is, I don't know. It's like a bar or some sort. A bar of metal. So, yeah, let's see how we get on. I'm going to make sure you use um, a piece of copper. Piece of copper wire. I'm feeling something in this field there. Next signal, it came up as silver, but it's not. It's, um, it's like a hinge. Just a brass hinge. Uh, I'll clean it up when I get back. It opens up actually. Yeah, it opens up. It's just a hinge. Next signal appears to be some sort of metal painted green. It looks like it's got a picture of a door in front of it. Um, and get it home and clean it up. But it's definitely got a picture of a door with number 30 on it. Alright. To cut a long story short, I had to cut my um, earlier farm expedition out because um, my son did dinner already, but um, just got onto this part here. Um, the first thing, a couple of inches down, not much, is uh, a 1921 penny. It's in quite a good condition, actually. Mm -hmm. So, it really wasn't that, even that far down, but I seem, I seem to find hundreds and hundreds of pennies on here. They used to have all sorts of festivals on here and stuff like that. But you've got to be careful of what junk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. You see the metal, the gold signals, which are the same as me scrap metal. So, anyhow, let's have a do. Next signal, bit of copper. Copper little ring. Next signal, 1899, Victoria, old head. Everything here seems to be four inches down, nothing more. There's like a layer of like stony gravel underneath a few inches of grass. Yeah, it's really weird. Yeah, we've got a couple of yards of um, the first coin. We've got another. It's pretty cool. But a couple more coins, but my next coin coming up. Little print there, it's 1990 penny. 1919. Oh, dear, just a mini roundup. Um, had a bit of a bad day, really. Not not a chance to get into things proper. Um, been pulled backwards and forwards from here than it were. But um, got some three pieces of scrap alley. Um, this I think is brass or bronze or copper. I'm um, not really sure. Gone green now, and um, some other scrap. Part of a toy car at one end of the field, and I found the other end at the other end of the field. I did about maybe five percent of this field because I had to go home and then back time have a bit of tea and my dinner and messed about with kids and it's been too late and I've had to go to the local park. But I found this on that farm this morning. Um, piece of metal with a slit in it. It's not iron but I don't know what it is. And it's got more everywhere now. And then I found a cube with three holes in and another four holes in. It's probably just some modern stuff I don't really know. And um, for coins I found two modern one pences two modern two peas twenty pence piece 
definitely got a date on it. Nineteen ninety two. Um oh sorry, three modern one piece, another one there. Um for older coins, got um an eighteen ninety nine Green Victoria and nineteen twenty one George five and 1919 George 5 so that's it really a bit disappointing really but in limited time that's something you can do so thanks for watching cheers next time is probably the most damaged weapons I've ever found in my life but um I feel it's not a Elizabethan because of the um, the three, it's like a thistle, it's like a thistle on it, but um, God knows what date, I'm going to see if they clean up, but it's, it's pretty bad condition. Next time there's another coin that I can't tell what it is, about the size of a half penny, a ship here me one, but I don't have a clue, I have to give it a clue when I get home. My next signal is a 1956 Elizabeth Halfpenny. My next find is quite disappointingly modern. It's just a piece of black painted metal. But I've got many cork cans around here, it's driving me mad. Let me take it back to that farmer over there. Weather's a bit better today, but I've only just finished work, so it's not got much time to get there and back. But hopefully with a bit of luck I might find something around here. So they're half penny up to now on the water cork and let's keep going. So I think we're gonna dig through to China for my next coin. Um it's quite a few wet down but um I don't know if you can see that there but um the feather's point face is pointing to the right. So I'm pretty sure it's an Edward coin but the other side I can't make anything out on it, but um it might come up with a queen, but I'm pretty sure it's Edward, um, early 1900s, so... Better look next time, eh? Between them two trees and the next queen. I know it's 1860. But, um I can't quite make out the, the, the last digit. But it's a half penny from 1860, it's Victoria. Got another large one penny, had it. I had it sobbed there, um, give off a, a good signal. Um, I'm not sure what date it is. I need to get it cleaned up, but um, fellow's facing to the left, so you're more or less 100% sure it's going to be one of the Georges. So, alright, cheers. Just a very quick round, round up for a couple of hours at the park. It's been out of work for the last few days because of weather, and been working bits and bobs and today it's one of the kids birthday so I want to come on for that but anyway here goes what I found up to, for today um, some copper some more copper or brass some scrap a pair of a cork cam another little black bit of black painted scrap metal um, some slag don't know why it's off it's quite heavy though um bit of lead um I've got a pound coin that you wouldn't believe but it was on I mean detector went off and I looked down with the on top so someone probably lost that just today. Um two modern one pennies a modern two pence um this it's half a penny, it's Victoria. Um and you can just make out it there. That's the um Britannia seated. And on the back you can just about make it out to your you want some eighteen sixty 
but it's more or less a smooth disc, really. Um, another half penny from 1956. See Elizabeth. Um, got um, a George penny. I'm not sure what date it is. You can see it's absolutely battered. This is rough as sandpaper, that bad boy. Um, I've also got another penny here. Penny here. It's definitely Edward. Face into it right. But, same again. I won't be able to get a day off that. It's absolutely ghost. But, so yeah, that's been a bit tough today. Yeah. Grab me toast and chill.